Welcome. Welcome. My name is Odetola Beniza Israel, and today I am going to be teaching you how to create a collaborative project, maybe like write up, maybe like a book, with the use of a very simple app. There are so many simple apps you can actually use to achieve this, but I'm going to be using one of the apps in this video, and in other videos, I'm going to be teaching you how to use the rest of the application. The app we are going to be using today is called Google Documents and then um, with the use of Google Documents, you can actually achieve a lot. So what exactly can you do with this app? I'm um, assuming you are in a class right now and then um, you are being grouped and then um, you want to do some notes taking and you want to make it a collaborative notes taking, maybe like a group of 10 students a group of five or a group of three three of them or ten of them can actually be chatting at the same time they can edit the content at the same time and everything will be very easy for them so they can actually be correcting somebody can be analyzing and more and also maybe you are in a meeting and um, you have about two to three secretary and then there is going to be a kind of um, no sticking of the minutes of the meeting so Three of them can actually also be on that same application to be doing some editing at the same time. So it is very easy. Maybe you are also you are about to write your book or you are working on your book and you have somebody that is editing your content and you want it to be done simultaneously. This also can be achieved. As the person is editing, you are going to be seeing what the person is editing at the same time. So let's start right away. Remember to subscribe to this channel. On this channel you'll be getting a lot a lot of value and um, we'll start right away so what exactly um, how do we get there just go to your google.com google.com so I'm going to google.com right away so when you get to google.com it's from google.com we are going to be um, achieving this wonder so when we get to google.com just click on this nine dots on this nine dot you find a lot of valuable valuable application there that you need to go and explore so I'm going to be clicking on drive Google Drive and then when I get to Google Drive from here this is where I'm going to find my Google document for me to use so um, this is Google Drive Google Drive is just like a drive for you to store a lot of material so a lot of materials can be stored here on google drive so i'm going to click on the word new on google drive you can find a lot of google application just like play store so they have their own application also over here on google drive so i'm going to click on new so when i click on new this is where i will find the application that we are going to be exploring today and there are also other application under google that can be used to achieve this there are also other applications that can be used to achieve this so you need to just do some findings to make this happen and then this video can also serve as an introduction towards more exploration so i'm going to click on google documents so as i click on google documents it is going to open in another tab okay so this is google document so the first thing i'm going to do is to change the title remember title is very important whenever you want to work on any material whether on canva whether on any tools change the title so this is um title education for for all so um education for all and the subject of the matter is um topic is uh, let's talk about um, education in africa okay so we are talking about this maybe um we just we want to deliberate on this topic and then i want everybody to come around about two to three or even more than even more even teachers can use this for training in the school environment so how do we go about this so what i need to do right now i'm going to click on the word share 
So when I click on the word share, I will come to the word change to anyone with the link. So when I get here, I will change it from viewer to editor. So I need it to be editor. So it's going to change to the word anyone on the on the internet with this link can edit. Good. So anybody can actually edit this. So the next thing I copy the link and I click on done. So what do I do to the link? I can go to WhatsApp, send the link to someone. So I'm going to be doing some testing. So I need to send the link to myself. So I'll send the link to myself. So what I'm going to do right now, let me go and assess this link. So the link I sent to myself is somewhere. I think, um, okay, let me open my... Okay, WhatsApp. And then um, this is the link I sent to myself. So you need to download um, um, this app also on your phone, which is Google Document, before you can open this. So I have a lot of mail, so I'm using the second mail because I've used the first mail to access it over there. So it's, as you can see, it is written there also. Um, topic, um, what's the topic again? Um, education in Africa. So let me do something. Let me do something. Let me copy or let me open. I want to open the. Okay, this is what I want to open. I want us to be seen. Remember, this is my laptop the white one is my laptop so just just note that so uh, what am i going to do so i'm going to let me switch back to the document okay so let me type now so you can see what is going to be going on oh education You can see that it's also typing at the same time and it is written there that i am typing with my name that i am the one good it is written that i am the one education in in Africa is easy to assess and a place to learn, unlearn and relearn. So as I am talking about this, the other person will be saying so likewise let me go and type on the laptop. You know, remember this is the white part of the laptop. Okay, that's so I can continue from where where the person where the other phone stop. That's good. Okay, I'm using upper case. What about some part of Africa without facility to learning materials, you know, so they can be doing a lot, a lot, a lot at the same time. So, as you can see, as I'm typing it, it is showing on top. So, about 20 people can join at the same time and more. So, I wanted to give it a try. Give it a try see what you can achieve with this with group of students secondary school can give this a try it is going to be very fun for secondary school to try this i think so and um, likewise our institution so if you are a student in our institution and um, you don't need to be writing no time okay? your smartphone can do this so somebody can create the document why Everybody jots and everybody will have access to it. So if there are somebody that is not 
that very smart and then maybe you are not good at note taking you can just be an observer why everybody write and you what you read so this is fun secondary school even uh, year six year five can also do work with this idea so i'm going to be giving you more trick more trick on how to create this collaborative on how to work on this collaborative platform and then i'm very sure you have learned something in this video thank you very much i really appreciate your time spent on this video thank you very much so give it a try it is very simple it is easy to use and um, i'm 100 sure that um, this is something that you find so you can download as i said you need to go and download google documents you can see this is google documents and i already have it on my on my on my phone this is my phone so get your google documents and use your google documents to assess your your material so thank you have a lovely time bye